Would you stop? The guy belongs in jail, all right? Okay, all right, so we'll save him a place right next to you. The bunk right on top, okay? Getting James Caan to star on Monday's Hawaii Five-O started with a phone call from producer Peter Linkoff to star Scott Caan, who happens to be James Caan's son. Peter called me and said, do you think your dad would be interested in doing the show? I said, yeah, I think so. I don't know why not. I, I, I think I said it'd probably be expensive or something like that. And then I asked him, he said, yeah, I'll do it if I can help come up with the character and you know have it be something that's fun for me. So they talked and figured it out. And it didn't take long to get this family reunion started. I mean, it's just obvious it was kind of natural. You know, with my kid, I miss him. He's down here all the time. So he asked me, and I thought it'd be fun. So I get to spend uh, eight, nine days with my boy, you know? Okay, book of muscles. I like these guys. Watching him, I learned more growing up on just someone I looked up to, A, as an actor. First of all, I think he's one of the better actors of all time, without question. But I learned a lot from him as a father, not so much as a, an artist, you know. In the episode, Khan plays Tony, a retired NYPD bomb officer now living in Hawaii. He's just, uh, you know, a little bit of a wacko. Does things his way, and uh, a friend of his gets involved in something that 5 -0 gets involved with, and then I'm forced to get involved with them. And getting the chance to play alongside son Scott made the idea of guest starring extra special. I mean, I love him more than anything. I mean, he's the best thing I've made, you know. I mean, I have other boys who were equally I love as much, but um, he's my oldest. He unfortunately spent the most time with me. He was attached to my hip when we were, he was two, so. Forget it that he's my father, he's a great actor, you know, more importantly. But, you know, on the other side of it, I get to hang out with my dad, which is cool, because I'm here so much, I don't get to spend time with him, so it's definitely a win-win for me. I get to work with a great actor, and I get to hang out with my old man. The Elder Khan says he's enjoyed watching his son's relationship with McGarrett develop on the show. What I like most about it is the uh, sort of improvisational feel that he and Alex have. Let me ask you something. You two hands peck at each other like this all the time, all the time. You know. Scott kind of loose, Alex a little loose. And that's okay with the guy who plays McGarrett. James Caan's a legend, you know I mean? He's one of the true legends of his time. I don't have to give you his bio. I mean, I'm sitting across from Sonny Corleone. We have a little group out here. That's why he is who he is. That's why he's the legend that he is. It's been a pleasure and uh, you're free to go, all right? Go, go, where, where, where am I going? Where am I gonna go to the beach, have a Mai Tai?